Wrestling is a big part of Rachel Kulstra's life. I've always like felt like drawn to it, but at first I was told that that's not what girls do. After her mom signed her up for the team at Lakeside High School, she became one of only two female wrestlers at the school. That first year was hard work, but worth it. She came back every year after. I had something to prove, and I wasn't quite sure what I was proving at the moment, but I knew this is something I wanted to stick with. And stick with it she did, all the way to a college scholarship. As her senior year came to a close, she was excited for her accomplishments to be celebrated in her senior yearbook. And I was looking at the wrestling section because I was like, it's my senior year. Like, I went to state. I'm going to be in it, you know. I was, like, really proud of all that. And there was, like, no pictures on either of the pages. And then I, like, read the paragraph and they just, like, my name wasn't even in there. The paragraph she's speaking about right here, it lauds the team's six seniors, listing them by name. The problem is there's actually seven students on that team that are a senior. The seventh one that is not included happens to be a female, and her name is Rachel. She's my daughter. Rachel says she understands yearbooks sometimes have errors. This one seems just a little too blatant, and it comes after years of what she says are similar, seemingly minor slights against a black woman in a predominantly white male sport. A lot of people tend to, whether they know it or not, they tend to share or express indirectly how they're not really for women's wrestling. Her father, Dan, says some people have recommended asking for a yearbook addendum, but he wants the whole yearbook reprinted. Rachel's not an addendum. Rachel doesn't go to the back of the yearbook. They've contacted a lawyer and filed a complaint with the NAACP. Rachel says it's more than about just her, it's about a broader culture that overlooks others like her. One day, I would like that to change around Nine Mile. I would like there to be a full women's wrestling team. Now, just about two hours ago, I spoke on the phone with the principal of Lakeside High School. He told me this year's yearbook was really across the board, not up to standards, and they're working to remedy that with an addendum. Here's some of that conversation. I know it's not the same, but, you know, uh, we're going to do the best we can to, to honor our kids. It's a human error. It's a, it's a kid business, and, and we get it. It hurts. Um, it was not the only error in the book, even. So do you understand why for the family, though, the it was an error might not be good enough of an answer to them? No, absolutely. I, I'm a parent, um, and, and I get it. Um, and nobody wants their, their student to not be mentioned, and so we feel terrible about it. And I would say that Rachel's a fabulous young lady. I'm a huge advocate. Uh, she's going to do great things.